cosmic ray particle, the muon, passes through the gas in the chamber, it leaves behind a thin trail of ionized gas. That is, the cosmic ray particle strips electrons from the atoms in the gas, leaving a short-lived trail of charged atoms. During this fleeting moment, the ionized path can conduct electricity. If a high voltage is applied to the gas, an electric current will flow along the ionized trail, making it glow like a spark. The spark chamber system is designed to quickly apply a very high voltage, 10,000 volts, between a set of horizontal flat plates. When a cosmic ray particle has passed through the gas, the high voltage is brief briefly turned on for a half millionth of a second before other gas atoms start to ionize from the spark. The reason the sparks are red is that the gas in the chamber is 90% neon, the same gas that makes neon signs look red. The cosmic ray particle is detected by a pair of detectors, one above the chamber and the other below. A particle that passes through the top and bottom detectors has also passed through the chamber. When the cosmic ray passes down through one of the flat scintillators, a very faint pulse of light is emitted. A photomultiplier tube attaches the scintillator, amplifies a faint luminous signal into an electric pulse that is sent to a discriminator located in the electronic spectrum. The discriminator possess, processes the noisy signal from photomultipliers and passes them to a coincident signal. When the coincident